Well, a Cache Valley company is hoping their new high-tech device can help keep businesses and also events running safely. Checks your temperature, and it also checks whether or not you're wearing a mask. And as news specialist Mike Anderson reports, there are hopes for it to do much more. Yeah, the hope is that the device can help out at businesses and events and ski resorts. They're testing it out here at the Ellen Eccles Theater tomorrow in Logan, and they say it can help at the workplace, too. So my temperature is 96.2. At a very basic level, yes, this is a fancy high-speed thermometer. I'm not wearing a mask. Please wear a mask. Shame on me. Uh, in this case, it's telling Please me. Please wear a mask. And it does seem to take offense if you don't mask up. But as Dustin Hansen explains, there is much more to what they call the Firefly Power Display. We focused on everything during this pandemic the last summer, uh, everything contactless, digital, and to keep people safe. Hansen runs Firefly Power Bikes during the summer. He wanted to find ways to make business safer and contact free, and he says it can be used at the workplace too, using facial recognition as people walk and clock in, logging their temperatures and sending that all to managers. This is one of a kind when it comes to actual the temperature check, the interactive display, automatic hand sanitizer, employee management software. Hansen also runs Cherry Peak Ski Resort during the winter. The power display will be there, and he's hopeful other resorts will pick it up too. This is what's going to help us keep places open. It's going to help us allow us to have events that maybe we couldn't have because of some of the certain guidelines we're doing. And if you think all of this seems a bit invasive, Hansen says so far. When people walk through, they get their temperature checked, and then guess what? They don't move on to the event. They're so interested in everything going on about the machine and what it's doing to keep everybody safe. And there is a spot on that screen for targeted advertising, too, which Hansen says can be used to subsidize the cost for businesses that want to use it. Mike Anderson, KSL 5 News. All right, Mike, thanks. Hey, whatever gets people back in. Right? Theaters and <laughs> ball games and all that stuff. <laughs>